Where's Rio? Yo, what's going on, guys? My name's Rio, and if you've not seen my face on your screen before, don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button down below because it does mean a lot. If you have and you're back for another amazing video, don't forget to hit that like button, it is appreciated. Basically, I'm going to talk about the KSI versus Joella fight, and this is like a topic that is going around YouTube. And basically, last night, Joella and KSI fought. KSI won, and I'll be touching on that later in the video. So, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. So we had the first fight, which was Exploring with Josh versus, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but it's like Yusof, 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 one of them. And basically, <laughs> to be fair, I think Exploring with Josh should have actually won because Exploring with Josh did go quite hard with his Nike Rossi shirt is on, but you know, hey ho, not really. <laughs> so you, you soft, you soft, you old soft won that fight, but I do think Exploring Josh should have done. And then the second fight, which was, I believe, the twins, I think, was it? Was it the twins? I think, I don't know. I missed one of the fights. I, I do believe I missed one of the fights. So the next fight that I watched was the twins, which was Jake twin and Liam twin, which like, Respect from going to a ring and that, but what was that? It was like, they were slapping each other. It's like, oh, you knocked the leg off me. Oh, stop that. It's like, bang! She just knocked him clean out. If that were my brother, I would have full on smacked him. And the next fight that I watched, I believe, was JMX versus Mike Fox. And everyone is going around, this is going around all Twitter. Mike Fox did lose the actual fight, but he, he won. Yeah. Mike Fox lost that fight, but then he won something much bigger which was getting a fiance because he did propose to his girlfriend which was absolutely amazing like that is just sick congratulations man he's never gonna watch this but you know congratulations man well well done because you're gonna fit bed <laughs> and then the main event ksi versus joella oh oh my lord basically like it that <clears throat> basically like oh my god like it was and it wasn't a good fight. Let me explain. So the first reason was KSI went in hard. Like KSI was being so confident and so big headed. I thought right KSI is going to be a little bitch in this fight. Like he's not going to do anything. But, but it was the other way around. Like this is my opinion. Joe Weller literally he was he, he said when 8,000 people are gonna see your head smashed against the canvas. I'm not being funny, pal. You hardly threw any punches. Like, that's the honest truth. You said you were gonna go and smash his head in, but you're the one with the bloody nose. You're the one who literally, literally, he had his hands up like this, yeah? And he didn't, he didn't do anything. That's the, like, I was watching it. I was getting annoyed at the fact that he wasn't throwing any punches back. Like, fair enough, he did throw some punches back, which, hit like hit KSI which was a good shot but then that was it like he just didn't do anything back like the first round I don't know did he throw one punch let, let me know because I don't even think he did like for the first round was, was him just getting smacked up by KSI like what are you doing like who goes into a boxing ring and hardly punches there's no point in even being in the boxing ring he literally did more damage to Elliot Crawford on the streets when he was boxing for like a, a laugh video like what are you even doing man Like, it actually annoyed me watching it, seeing someone say they're gonna smash one's head in and then hardly throw any punches. Like, it's just annoying. Like, congrats for KSI for literally doing everything he said he was going to do. Like, KSI said that he's gonna just go in hard for uh, Joe Weller and that's generally what he did. Like, fair enough, man. You did well and you won the match. This is the funny bit. Basically, at the end of the boxing match, KSI called out a few people. So, the first people he called out was Jake Paul and Morgan Paul. And then, he went on to say, right, I was watching this with my friend, and he went on to say, where's Rio? I'm like, I'm here, I'll fight you. Well, well, <laughs> obviously, mine's got this belt right now. If any YouTuber wants it, you can come get it. Jake Paul, Jake Paul, Logan Paul, any of the pools, I don't care. Bring it. Same, yo, if any celebrity wants it, yo, where's Rio? Basically, if you if you want me and KSI to fight, 
yeah so if you want me and KSI to fight don't forget to hit that like button down below and subscribe so basically KSI calls me out he wants to fight me I'll take that bell off him I'll smash his face in. So guys, basically that's my kind of views and opinions on the case I versus Joe Weller fight. There's gonna be a lot of videos out there talking about this situation, so I'm not gonna ramble on because basically like everyone's gonna be talking about it. So I might as well just make the video because that's what everyone's talking about. If you've not seen my previous video, which is the types of people during exams, it is a funny video, so go check it out. Link will be wait, I got this wrong last time. I said down there, so I presume it's up there. I think. Also, don't forget just to go to my channel, be a G, subscribe, peace!